Tri-State Arena Cross is racing to the Mountain Health Arena in Huntington this weekend. And look who we have. We've got Cameron Farmer, the Arena Cross track manager here to tell us all about it. Hi there, Cameron. Hi, how are you doing today? Great. Okay, tell us what we're going to be in for this weekend in Huntington. Well, guys, um, we are uh, racing uh, some dirt bikes here in the Mountain Health Arena um, on a uh, basically a motocross track, it's arena cross track. Um, arena cross, this is a four lane track, uh, will consist of a start, rhythm section, finish line, and whoops. Um, we're gonna have uh, up to 16 riders on the line at a time, multiple classes. Uh, we got riders starting all the way from four years old, uh, all the way up to 74 years old. Um, this is a series race, so they are racing for points for a championship. Uh, this is the final round as well, so a lot of the points are close. Uh, you can see we got a lot of action as well. Y'all need to come check that out. Um, so the points are close this year, so we're going to have a lot of nitty gritty uh, bar banging action. Uh, so we can all expect to be on the edge of our seat, and it's uh, going to be a great time here at the Mountain Health Arena this weekend. Yeah, it always is. So exciting to watch, and I, I still can't believe you have riders as young as four years old and as old as 74. That is amazing. Um, how many years have you all brought Arena Cross to the tri-state area now? Uh, well, Tri-State Arena Cross has been doing this uh, for just a little over 10 years now. Uh, we actually originally started in Pikeville, Kentucky. Uh, that was the first venue that we were able to book and get our hands on, um, and we kind of took off from there. Um, this year, we actually consisted of Utica, Ohio, uh, Millersburg area. Uh, we were in Lexington, Kentucky for two rounds, and then we were in Huntington here for two rounds. Uh, this is the final round, like I said. Uh, but Arena Cross action has actually been going on here at the uh, this Civic Center for uh, almost 40 years. For nearly 40 years, they've been racing dirt bikes in here, bringing dirt in here, um, and racing. So uh, we've been here for the last six, six of that. So uh -huh. it's been it's been a fun journey. Oh, and speak about the fun. I mean, we're watching some of the video while you were talking of all the like just flying through the air. I mean, what does that feel like when you're on the bike and you're doing it? Uh, it's adrenaline rushing. Uh, it's 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 amazing. Um, you know, I've jumped uh, some really big jumps in my life. Um, but you jump for show, you turn for dough. Uh, so, you know, you got to know how to how to make it through the turns correctly. The jumps are really, they're an obstacle. Um, but, uh, you know, it, it, we're indoors. I got some nice big jumps here. I'm actually standing on the finish line right now. Uh, we're looking at about a 50-foot gap from end to end. Uh, so that's going to be pretty cool to launch these dirt bikes through here inside the arena uh, as we got 16 riders coming. Um, I myself have actually, this will be my 21st anniversary uh, racing. My very first race 21 years ago was in this arena um, about about the same time, the second weekend in February. Wow. So um, to come and do this six years, you know, be, be doing this for six years and, mm -hmm. and starting here 21 years ago um, is super cool. It's a dream come true, and I uh, can't wait to continue. Wow. Well, we can't wait to see you all. So remind us about ticket prices and when and where it all happens. Okay, yeah, so this is going to happen uh, Friday and Saturday. Uh, we do have uh, two sessions. We have a morning session, which are our younger riders, um, and then we have our main show, which is in the, uh, the evening time. We do offer some of the uh, younger rider classes as well, um, but in that evening shows where you see a lot of them crashes that y'all were seeing, uh, so it'll be interesting. Tickets, you can get your tickets uh, at the front door. Uh, I believe they're right around $36. Um, so just stop it to stop up there at the box office. Box office. Uh, totally recommend using the box office and not getting them online. Um, the prices are a little better. So um, yeah, y'all need to come check it out. The show starts at seven uh, both nights. So I recommend coming down about 6:30. Um, if you get here about 6:15, um, you can get the chance to maybe even get on the track and, and walk it if we're not uh, if we're not needing to prep it uh, if we have it ready and stuff. But uh, all the festivities kick off right around seven o'clock. Oh PM. wow. Very cool. And best of luck to all of you. Hopefully no one will get injured. Just have lots of fun there. Uh, Cameron, great talking with you. Thanks for sharing this with us today. Yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, we couldn't do it without the support of uh, some of our sponsors. We got Boyd Cat, the rental store on board. Uh, we got Collins Career and Technical Center right here out of the area. They're on board helping us out. 560 Graphics, Interstate Batteries, Gateway Cycle, Central Kentucky Motorsports. Uh, big thank you to all these people helping make that happen. And uh, if, you're, if you're able to, make sure you support them as well because they support us. Great. Cameron, best of luck. We can't wait to see it. Thank you. I hope you all come out and join. Yep.